breaking news in New York. It's sunny. I mean, I'm not joking or anything. It's really sunny. Ooh. Yes. So, because I saw the sun outside, it just made me come Hudson River because that's where I come in summer, day and night. So today I want to talk about my Tough Mother experience. So Tough Mother is an obstacle race. Obstacles as you jump, you climb, you have to get through a, a lot of obstacles to finish the race. So I really like want to inform my friends and people who want to do Tough Mother or they are not sure if they should do. Here's my ideas, my suggestions to you. You should know what you're really joining. I know if your friend may ask you, it sounds fun. It is fun if you enjoy a little bit of challenges and not giving up because it's 12 and a half miles of obstacles with an unsecured atmosphere. So I've been in Europe in a lot of obstacle places, like this type of places. You always have to have a rope that secure your body to the, to the trees or wherever you are. And in Top Mother, it's like a thousand people joining at the same time. There's no such a security. So what does that mean? It means you know that when you're signing that, if I die, all responsibility is mine. They really mean it, it's your responsibility. Nine and a five miles. I was with a broken finger and, and the very hurt knees and feet that I couldn't walk anymore. I couldn't walk. So the emergency guys came and I was waiting for the car and they are like, oh, you're lucky. Like a lot of people break their legs. And another tip is like Tough Mother is a lot about the, the teamwork, your group members. You can't do it without it. So it's like a journey that you take a road trip or you live with someone that then you know that person. I think decide before you go, if you don't want to lose your friendship with someone or if you want to test your friendship with someone, Tough Mother is something like that because you need a hand that holds you and pull you up or, or pull you up from the river or hold you in the river. Oh my God. It's a very, very big teamwork. It's like we were 20 people in the group. We all waited for each other. That's why the first seconds when they stopped for me, the game just started and they are waiting for me. I was just terrified. Number three, train. Like train like hell means train, but especially run. A lot of running is required. Another very important thing is like know when you have to give up. Don't just do it because you have to do it like I did, like I, I didn't have to do it. When you feel pain, like not a little bit of pain, I'm talking about a lot of pain, just stop. Like it's not death and live situation. You don't have to finish the parkour. My, what, what would I do differently is, I would just give up. Like if I knew it's gonna be like this, I would just, oh, you know what? My finger is broken and my knee, I don't feel good. I can't really run anymore. I give up. I would say that. Because I force and I force and our body is not a toy. Like you have to know what, what it wants and if it gives reaction that stop, you have to stop. That's what I would do differently. Yeah, enjoy. Enjoy the tough mother and Enjoy the stories you will tell your co-workers, your friends, your, your daughters, your grandsons. I think 
it works to do once in a lifetime. Like, just once, once in your life you can do it.